Hi, uh, this video tutorial I will show you the example of uh, request dispatcher. Uh, before you watch this video tutorial, please log into my channel and watch uh, request dispatcher introduction video tutorial. Then come and watch this tutorial so that you will understand this tutorial very clearly. Okay. Uh, here uh, you can see the index.html. Uh, it has a name and password. So user has to enter uh, username and password and uh, click on login. So once uh, this login button is clicked, uh, the request will send you to the login servlet. So what this uh, login servlet will do is, uh, it will check username and password is uh, valid or not. If it is valid, then it will forward the request to welcome servlet, which will uh, display the welcome message. Suppose uh, username and password is uh, not valid, then uh, it will display sorry username or password error and uh, it will include the index.html file. Okay, uh, we will see how uh, it is done in the coding level. I will open Eclipse and I will uh, explain it properly. Okay, uh, to explain uh, request dispatcher example, I have created a request dispatcher uh, demo web application. Uh, what I will do is I will uh, uh, deploy this application in Tomcat first. File export var file next browse and I am placing inside the tomcat uh, web apps folder then I am going to start the server uh, the server has been started uh, now I am accessing the web application using this URL I am entering uh, now so it will display index.html content. Uh, I will open uh, index.html in uh, Eclipse. Uh, so this is index.html uh, page. It has username and password and uh, login button. So once you click on login button, uh, the post request will be sent to the server. And the action is uh, login. Okay. So first I will enter correct username and password. RAM, RAM and password is also RAM. Okay, then I am clicking on uh, login button. So the request uh, uh, goes to the server, and uh, server what it will do is uh, it will forward the request to the servlet container. So here uh, URL pattern is login. Okay, so the servlet container will use this uh, URL pattern name which is uh, login and uh, check in the web.xml. Okay. Uh, so for uh, URL pattern login, uh, corresponding uh, servlet is uh, login servlet. So the servlet container will uh, load this login servlet class and uh, it will instantiate. Then it will call the init method of uh, login servlet to initialize this servlet. Uh, then it will call the do post method to uh, process the request. Uh, because in index.html we specified uh, method as post. So do post method will be called by the servlet container to process the request. Now we will see the login servlet uh, content. So login servlet uh, extends HTTP servlet and it has init method. Uh, this will be called by the servlet container to initialize this servlet and it has uh, do post method uh, which will be called by the servlet container uh, to process the request and uh, send the response back to the client and it has uh, destroy method. Uh, when the servlet is uh, taken out of uh, service this method will be called. Uh, so basically when uh, server shut down uh, this method will be called. Uh, so now we will see uh, do post method uh, what logic uh, we have written. Okay. So in do post method uh, first what we are doing is we are getting the username and password. If uh, username and password is uh, correct then uh, we are forwarding the request to the uh, welcome servlet using the request dispatcher. Okay. If uh, username and password is wrong, then we are displaying uh, sorry username or password is wrong and uh, we are including the index.html uh, content using the request dispatcher. Okay. Uh, we will see what is there in welcome uh, servlet. So welcome servlet uh, extends HTTP servlet. It has uh, init method and uh, do post method uh, what it will do is uh, it will get the username and uh, it will uh, display welcome that username okay and it has uh, destroy method uh, 
so I entered uh, correct username and password so the request forwarded to uh, welcome servlet by the login servlet and uh, welcome servlet uh, displayed this uh, welcome rom uh, information okay uh, suppose uh, if I enter uh, wrong username and password then what uh, login servlet will do is uh, it will include index.html and uh, then it will display a sorry username or uh, password is wrong okay and uh, this is about uh, request dispatcher uh, demo and uh, thanks for watching bye